Total body photography assists in the early detection of skin cancer and is valuable for avoiding unnecessary biopsies. It allows the capturing and analyzing of total body images by storing those photos of different body parts and supports you in detecting any new or changing lesions. To get started, go to your patients list and select the patient you wish to add total body images to and press the icon at the bottom. Select the Serial Total Body Photography button and you'll be able to quickly take these images in order of body parts listed, starting with the head. To help ensure images are captured from a consistent distance, an imaging outline will appear for you to center the patient's body part. You also have the option of turning it off by tapping Ghost Off in the corner. Make sure you tap to focus and press the camera button. You now have the option of cropping or retaking your image. Once happy, press next and continue imaging until completed. You can also skip body parts if they do not require imaging. Alternatively, you can directly select a body part and image individually. It is extremely important that image acquisition is done correctly. For high quality images, maintain a distraction free and consistent background in a well lit space. In order to provide even lighting, it's recommended that you use the Optima Light attachment. Next to each body part segment, you'll notice the number of images uploaded for that patient. Simply select the body part you wish to image and then tap the camera icon. Previously taken images will appear at the top of the screen, where, if tapped, a silhouette of the image will appear to assist you in taking a new image as close to the old one as possible. Once you've completed total body imaging, you can then add corresponding dermoscopic images easily. Let's add a dermoscopic image. Go to your desired body part, then select the TVP image you would like to start mapping. Then press Detect Lesions and select the lesions of concern. Hit Next and attach your mobile dermoscope to your smartphone. For the best imaging quality, make sure your phone and device's lenses are clean. Remember to tap to focus on the spot. When focused, tap the camera button to take your image. Once done, the app will prompt you to place the spot on the 3D body map. Simply tap the corresponding area on the body to place. Once happy with the placement, press place to finish. Let's run through this process one more time. Step one, select the body part. Step two, select the image. Step three, detect lesions. Step four, select lesions of concern. Step five, take dermoscopic images. And step six, map to 3D body map. Designed to connect seamlessly between your smartphone and computer, DermEngine goes wherever you do. You have the power to take images directly from the DermEngine app where they'll be uploaded to the web platform in real time. Or if you prefer, you can take the images with your own camera where they can be easily uploaded to the web platform. You can now map your lesions. Go to your patient and use the three dot icon to select TBP images, also known as total body photography images. Select a body part, and the image you would like to map to the 3D body map. You can select a spot by clicking on it, where you'll notice a teal circle appear around it. To document multiple spots at once, hold Ctrl on Windows or Command on Mac and click on as many spots as you'd like. When ready, click Start Mapping one by one, Dermension will highlight the selected lesions on the image and prompt you to place the corresponding spot on the patient's body map. Here, you can add a new spot or click on an existing spot, which will be a faint teal color to help you easily differentiate it. As you map the lesions, you'll notice them appear in the right side column. The existing spots will include their spot name and number. Please note, once a spot has been mapped, you have three seconds to undo, so you can take your time when mapping a new spot. 
For your convenience, the Images and Detected Lesions tab will automatically switch based on your actions. Once finished, click Save to Body Map. For back images, you have the option of manual or bulk mapping. Bulk mapping is helpful for patients who have a lot of lesions that you wish to map to the 3D body map. To get started, adjust the slider to your preferred sensitivity and click Start Mapping. You can now resize the red rectangle to reflect the same area as the body map. When ready, select Map to Body Map, and once you're happy with the results, click Submit. In other cases where you only wish to map a few lesions of concern, you can manually map these for a quicker experience. Simply click the lesions you'd like to map and click on Start Mapping or the Body Map icon. Once you're finished mapping a patient's lesions, you have the ability to capture and associate dermoscopic images with a spot. Select Take Images on App. Select your device and confirm by pressing Take Images on Device. Attach your dermoscope and take your dermoscopic images. Here you can take multiple dermoscopic images by simply hitting the camera button. In the bottom left corner, you can see how many dermoscopic images you've already taken. If you haven't already, map the spot to the patient's body map. To help ensure the accurate placement of the spot, it's recommended that you use images of the patient's body part found in the top row as a point of reference. Once added, tap Place. From here, you have the ability to take dermoscopic images or simply tap Done when complete. For follow-up appointments, you can now compare images and use lesion matching to automatically detect any changes. To begin matching, click the desired body section, then select the images you would like to compare and click on Start Matching. All detected lesions will be paired in the viewing column on the right. These will be sorted and color-coded based on the amount of change with one being purple for change detected, blue for possible change detected, and lastly, gray for no change detected. From here, you have the ability to review the list. Clicking an image will provide you with the following three actions. Take image, no change, or wrong match. Please note when selecting take image, if there is a changed lesion that has not already been mapped, you'll be prompted to do this on the mobile app. To get a better look at any changes in a lesion, use the parallel pan and zoom feature to get a magnified view of both lesions at once. If you select wrong match, the matched pair will be removed. You can now create a new pair at any time. Click on a lesion you would like to map, then click on its counterpart in the second image. Confirm you would like this part to be matched, your new pair will then be labeled manually added. In addition to parallel pan and zoom, DermEngine offers the Flickr tool as an easy method for viewing and detecting changes. Once you've loaded two images into the viewing pane, simply click the Flickr button. Here, the two images will then lay over one another and Flickr to help highlight any potential changes. You can zoom in on certain lesions to notice any subtle differences. Enjoy the efficiency and quality of total body photography. Dermatology made intelligent.